my marionette tutorial. This is a lot more creepy than I planned it to be. Like I meant it to be creepy but ugh. So this is the perfect look for going out on a date or playing a game. But if you want to see how to create this look keep watching and enjoy. I look like Edna from The Incredibles. Like this wig is not meant for my face. <laughs> no capes. I started off by drawing the eyebrows. I'm using a black eyeliner pen for this. This works a lot easier than a pencil, especially for the beginning of the brow. The curve part is the hardest to match, so take your time and don't be afraid to erase and start over. With NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk, I lined my waterline and then brought it down to extend the whites of my eye. With the same eyeliner pen, I traced around the edges of the white and then brought it up to the lid. I filled it in all the way up to my crease and I added a black eyeshadow over the top of the lid to take away any shine. I added mascara and then added lashes to the top and bottom. I lined up the bottom lashes with the black line. With NYX lip liner and plush red, I trace my lips. I then filled it in with Madame Glam's lipstick in Raisin. With BH Cosmetics 3rd Generation Palette, I used a brown shade to start deepening the smile creases. I used a small brush at first, but then blended it out with a large fluffy brush. I continued on to the nose to make the tip a little bit more round. I started with a small brush on the mouth lines and blended inward towards the lips. I also rounded my chin a little bit more. Then with a larger brush, I blended everything out. With the same black eyeliner, I carefully added a line to make the mouth stand out more. I then went over it with a brown eyeshadow. I also darkened everything around the edges. No terrifying doll is complete without a buttload of blush. And finally, with the same brown eyeshadow or with a brown eyeliner, add the freckles. That's it! You're done! Go terrify people!